In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Valorant keeps crashing mid-game. So in case your Valorant is k crashing on and on once you're playing, this may fix your issue, okay? The first thing out of the 8 we're going to talk about is that you have to make sure your specs meet the minimum requirements. So the operating system for Valorant should be Windows 7, 8, 10 or 11, 64-bit. The processor should be this one. You should have at least 4 gigabytes of RAM, so uh, yeah, that's it. And then you want the graphics card to be at least Intel HD 4000, okay? Now, uh, if you have this and there's no reason the game is crashing because your system requirements, then we're going to head to the next step, which is to close resource-hungry software. There's many ways of doing it. You can simply close it down in the taskbar in case you're running, for example, let's say Chrome or any other programs. You want to close those down. Or you want to go over here to where it says show hidden icons, click it and close down all the apps that may be eating space. So for example, let's say Discord in my case, I have Steam and stuff like that. And then um, if that didn't work, you may want to go to the taskbar, right click, task manager, and add some tasks in here that may be causing a lot of, uh, they may be eating a lot of memory or CPU and stuff like that. You'll see which ones they are. Just don't close down anything. You don't know where it is because it's a file that your computer needs to function. Make sure it's a program you have installed and you're comfortable with closing down. The third thing is to update your graphics driver. That's pretty straightforward. You have to update your graphics card drivers. Um, depending on which graphics card you have, if you have Intel, if you have um, AMD, or if you have uh, Nvidia, you may want to install the new drivers and install them. So the third option is to install all Windows updates because some updates may be interfering with your game and that may be the reason for your crashing and lagging. So the way you do this is by going to search box down here and typing in updates and you wanna click on check for updates. It will open up this screen where you want to press check for updates inside settings and this will uh, find if there's any updates that you haven't updated on your computer yet, okay? Now, if that's if that's the case, if it finds something, make sure you install that update, re restart the computer and that's it. Then, you may want to stop overclocking. So in case you have uh, overclocked your computer, make sure you revert it back to normal and that may stop the crashes. Then. If none of these worked, you may want to lower your in-game settings so you get more FPS and a, a smaller chance of the game actually crashing. Then you may have to temporarily disable your antivirus because it may be interfering with your game. So you do this by going down here, show hidden icons, select your antivirus. For me, I have Avast, so I'm going to right click it and then Avast Shields Controls. Uh, and then you want to disable it for let's say an hour and see if that works. Now, if it doesn't work, if it's nothing better, if it's no better, if the crashes are still happening, you may want to simply um, kind of enable all the, shield, all the shields back on because that's not the issue. Now, uh, you may also want to make an exception inside your Google Defender or uh, I mean um, uh, Windows Defender or your antivirus, which may also help solve the issue. And if none of this worked, you may have to reinstall Valorant and Vanguard on your computer and then restart the computer. So delete both, uninstall both, restart the computer and then reinstall them and see if the, still, if the crashing still persists. So I hope any of these helped you out and if it did, I'm glad it did. And uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.